2014, 15, 16, 17, 18. Kia Soul front brake pad replacement. How to replace a front brake pads. First thing, we gotta remove the tire. We're gonna be removing your tires. Then we're gonna be opening up uh, 14 millimeter two screws, one here, one over here. Ready. So this and this, it's going on a side. I will put it over here. Um, if you are not comfortable putting over here, you can tie. You can have. Um, if you think you're gonna drop it and it's gonna break, then you can basically tie with something over here with this one. Uh, some people use a tie wrap, or uh, you can do whatever you like to do alrighty now we're gonna be removing our brake pads I'm gonna be using this screwdriver to peel them off alrighty and I'm gonna try to take them out as straight as possible so I won't get stuck and I am still stuck I'm gonna be using a plier to To hold this pin so it can stay there right here and and try to take it out there you go it's out now the second one let's try to take it out without screwdriver I hope it's easy one it's came out it's came out by itself now this is the condition of our old brake pads. Have no life left. Front brake pad. And look at this thickness. All right, now I'm gonna be using I'm gonna be removing this one as well. It's very dirty. Well, it, a lot of people use existing one, but I don't wanna use the existing one because new one is gonna be better. Now I'm gonna be cleaning this one. The hole where this clip thing's supposed to go in. same way the top one top one have should have a less dust but I still gonna try to clean rust and dirt be good now I'm gonna be using this one over here lined up lined up and push it down
Okay, I'm gonna take a screwdriver. I'm gonna put it here. And gonna bang a little bit. That's good. This part is good now. Alrighty, the top one. It's gonna be a little tricky because you can't see it properly. But it's the same formula. Same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing. Now ready. Part is good. No. So this one is gonna go on engine side. This one, and I'm gonna lubricate a little bit. I'm gonna use a lubricator. Not a much, a little bit. All right, this is going on a back. All right, this side is gonna be going on a back because of this, and this is gonna be on the bottom side. All right, put it over here. And, and, and. Let me bend myself and make sure it is on the right place where it's supposed to go. Put the outside one first now. All right. 
this one set nice how I know it is set nice because it is flat so the other one I have to see Let me go ahead and turn the car and move the direction for this uh, tire. So then I can see easily. I guess this is gonna be easier and it should because I can see now better There you go. Thank you very much. Now I can see both of them sit nice. Great. So while this is here, I'm going to go ahead and put the caliper. And one more thing need to be done is a caliper. How to push the caliper back. So since this is a front one, there is no special tool required other than this one already ready you can see right here I already cleaned this area so I won't damage the seal it's going nice and smooth there you go it's full set back. Now. Next screw is right here. So this is a 14 millimeter.
Alrighty, perfect. Now I can literally put the car back. done with this stuff so the job is done so I just gonna put the tar back I gonna make I gonna screw it up again and put the tar back and that's it it's about 14 15 minutes job that's it take it guys